Brownies are a favorite dessert among many people. Knowing how to know when brownies are done is key to getting the recipe just right. Though it can be hard waiting for them to bake, you don't want to pull them out of the oven too soon. The amount of time you cook a brownie will also depend on how you like your brownies. Some people prefer a fudgy brownie that is gooey while others like cakey brownies with a finer crumb. No matter what kind of brownie you like, you don't want the batter to still be wet from being underdone or the brownies dry from being overcooked. Types of brownies. When it comes to brownies, there are three main types. The main types are chewy, fudgy, and cakey. These types of brownies will often bake for different times as they have different consistencies. Fudgy. Fudgy brownies are famous for their gooey centers. Compared to cakey brownies, they contain more fat, such as butter and chocolate. They also have a lower amount of flour. Fudgy brownies are very chocolatey and rich. They have a dense, moist interior and are often served when they are still warm. Cakey. Cakey brownies have a similar consistency to a cake. They have a moist crumb and a slightly fluffier interior. They contain a lower amount of fat and a higher amount of flour compared to the other types of brownies. Chewy. Chewy brownies are the classic type of brownies and they are also the most popular. They have a lovely chocolate flavor with a chewy exterior. They are slightly gooey in the middle, but not as much as fudgy brownies do. Chewy brownies are less dense than fudgy brownies while having a moist, tender crumb. They are the middle ground between fudgy and cakey brownies. How do you know if brownies are done? The best way to tell if your brownies are done is by using a toothpick or metal skewer. Baking brownies for too little or too long can result in an undesirable consistency. The brownie toothpick test is the most popular way to see if your brownies are ready. For fudgy brownies, the toothpick should have some streaks of chocolate along with some moist crumbs. They will often cook for a couple of minutes less than the other types of brownies. Cakey and chewy brownies are done baking when a toothpick inserted into the middle comes out with a few moist crumbs. If the toothpick has streaks on it then it needs to bake for longer. If the toothpick is clean after being inserted into the middle, the brownies are overcooked. Another way to see if they are done is to look for a crack on top. Cracking, which you have a shiny and set appearance, means that the brownies are ready to come out of the oven. Another way to tell if cakey brownies are done is to look at the edges. If they are beginning to pull away from the sides of the pan, they are finished. For best results, bake brownies for the time recommended in the recipe. It is often a good idea to bake them on the lower end of the suggested time. If they aren't yet done, simply bake them for a couple more minutes. Be sure to bake the brownies at the temperature the recipe says. You don't want to bake them at a too high or too low temperature, as this will affect when they are done. If you are making brownie bites, the bake time will be much shorter. However, the method for checking if they are done is the same. Best way to bake brownies. When baking brownies, it is best to bake them in a light-colored metal pan. Using a glass pan will take several minutes longer and won't ensure an even bake. Though glass is alright to use if you have nothing else, it is best to go with metal instead. Most brownie recipes will call for an 8-inch square pan, a 9-inch square pan, or a 9 by 13 inch pan. It is always best to stick with the size your recipe calls for to ensure an even bake. In addition, it is best to line your baking pan with parchment paper or aluminum foil before pouring your brownie batter. This will prevent the brownies from sticking to your pan and make them easier to remove. It is a simple hack that will make cutting and serving them much easier. Before slicing into your brownies, you should wait 30 minutes or up to 4 hours. This will give you a clean cut and allow the chocolate flavor to further develop. For best results, store your brownies in an airtight container at room temperature for about 5 days. In addition, they also freeze well for up to 3 months. Wrap them tightly in plastic wrap and then aluminum foil or instead place them in a Ziploc bag. Delicious perfectly baked brownies. No matter what type of brownie you make, you will want to if they are properly baked. 
You don't want brownies where the center is still wet or ones that are dry and overdone. Using a toothpick is the easiest and most accurate way to tell when brownies are done. If the toothpick has wet batter on it, it will need to bake for longer. If the toothpick has some streaks and moist crumbs, your fudgy brownies are done. For the chewy and cakey types, they are done when there are a few moist crumbs. If there are no crumbs and the toothpick is clean, they are overbaked. In addition, you can also look for cracking as a sign they are done. Once done, let your brownies cool for at least half an hour before digging in. This will help ensure the best tasting brownie. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.